Here is a demonstration of the eFail direct exfiltration attack uh, on Apple Mail, um, including how brittle the current mitigations against it are. So uh, here's Apple Mail, and if we look at preferences, I have unchecked this box, load remote content and messages. And you should definitely uncheck this box, because if it's checked and somebody sends you an email that tries to exploit this, then it will just automatically exploit it and they'll get the plain text of your email. But if you uncheck it, then it won't be automatic. Um, and then uh, over here, I am uh, looking at the access logs for a web server. So here is the encrypted email. Um, it includes a top secret passphrase. If we view the source, we can see that it's encrypted, and here's the um, actual PGP block. Um, okay, and so over here, this is an email template that I wrote that includes uh, a copy of that same PGP block. And so let's go ahead and send this email. Okay, email sent, and and here's the email. Um, so it says uh, this message contains remote content, and um, the reason why it says this is because I unchecked that. Uh, if I just left the default settings for Apple Mail, then it just would automatically load it. But I'm gonna go ahead and click load remote content because I wonder what's different. And boom, here is the plain text of that email that was decrypted. And here is the top secret passphrase. And here it all is.